This is questions 66 through 68 of the New York State Chem Regents exam, June 2015. Answer the questions for yourself. Pause the video, check your answers and explanations if you get anything wrong. Okay, question 66. It's asking to state the atomic number and the mass number of this element. So you take a look at the picture, and it's a picture of the Bohr model. What you need to do is you need to take a look at the information here, given above the picture. Always realize that these dark solid lines, all three of these questions, you might need information to answer the question. So, the atomic number. One of the things you always want to keep in mind is atomic number is always number of protons. So your atomic number is 4 and the mass number. Remember your mass number is protons plus neutrons. 4 plus 5 is 9. So your atomic number, number of protons is 4. Your mass number, protons plus neutrons, is 9. Let's take a look at 67. State the number of electrons in each shell in this atom in the ground state. Okay, so because its atomic number is number 4, you, can, you know the identity of the element. Just look at the periodic table. Element 4 is beryllium. Now, underneath the number 4, you see the electron configuration, 2-2. Two -two. That tells you two electrons are in the first shell and two electrons are in the second shell. So there's your answer. The number of electrons for the first shell is 2, and the number of electrons for the second shell is 2. Finally, the last question. Using the Bohr model, describe the changes in electron energy and electron location when the atom changes from the ground state to the excited state. Okay, so electron energy, electron location. Make sure you always read the statement or the question before you go to answer it. So you have to answer two questions here, just like in 66 and just like in 67. Okay, so what happens to electron energy going from the ground state to the excited state? Well, electrons will move out from the nucleus, going from the ground state to the excited state. So the electron energy increases. Sorry for the handwriting. Okay. The other thing that happens is electron location. The electron is further away from the nucleus. For the answers to 68, you could have said the electron energy increases, electron has more energy, electron absorbs energy. For electron location, answers that would be acceptable include moving further away from the nucleus, going from the first shell or energy level into the second shell or energy level. Any one of those combinations would work. Check out www.newyorkchemcoach.com for more questions, explanations, and good luck.